Southwest Florida, for a night out on the town, people always say Naples, Naples, Naples. But right down the road is Island Fun on Marco for that small, cozy night on the island feel. And a night out on the island? That's fun. Welcome to Zoe Flow Life. This is Natalie Kirstein. Natalie's a local on Marco, so she and her friends just know where to go. Well, step number one is knowing what's going on and where to go on the island. And I know where to go on the island, because I live there. <laughs> Natalie says in Southwest Florida, nightlife on Marco is kind of under the radar. Only Marco Islanders really understand the nightlife situation. There's a warmth when you go out on your island and you go to your places. It's friendly, it's local, it's fun, it's familiar. So she and her friends took me out to some of their favorite spots to kind of feel the vibe. We started at the world famous Snook Inn. The Snook is a special place. It's been there for years. There's a lot of different aspects. Boaters boating up, saw dolphins up on the upper deck. It's just a special place. You can go across the world and people have heard of the Snook Inn. It's the place to be on Marco Island. Then a little stop at Oyster Society, which sits at the Marco Walk Plaza. This plaza is always busy. Restaurants and bars surround a beautiful open courtyard sitting area. Very warm, friendly. Great place. Atmosphere just feels so chill. When you get there, you just want to stay there. The music was really good too. The, the saxophone player. <laughs> so nice. Then it was off to the boardroom tavern. Boardroom tavern, it's kind of tucked away. It's not a place you're gonna know is there. It's something that's just kind of you have to find or someone you have to know. It does have that Key Westy feel, kind of tucked in there and off the beaten path. And it's a great locals hangout. When you're there, you feel like you're in the know. It's that kind of place. We finished up. Natalie took me to some of her favorite spots at the beautiful Marco Marriott, including Quinn's, Cane's, 10K Alley, and of course, some of the most beautiful beaches in Southwest Florida. Well, when you go out on an island, it's very familiar. Smiling, friendly, familiar faces. You feel like you're at home. You're out, but you still feel like you're at home. And it's just very comfortable. It's friendly. That's the way to describe Marco Island. It's friendly. I can't go anywhere without running to someone I know on Marco Island. <laughs> That's what it's like being on an island.